Hi family, so this is my last wash day routine in my home. So I hope you guys enjoy this setting, enjoy the background because this will probably be your last time seeing it. Today is Friday. I'm filming this video for tomorrow, which is Saturday. I'm going to be doing my full wash day routine today. Um, and then after I plan to do a wash and go because on Monday we're supposed to be going to sign the papers and turn our house keys over to the new owner so i plan to wear my hair in wash and go for that and then after we have to move to the hotel there where we will be staying until we can finalize on our home that we are buying so for my wash and go you guys know my routine my pre-poo my shampoo deep condition and then i will put my hair in wash and go so i plan to do this video in two parts the first part is just me washing my hair and then the second part i'm going to be using a new gel that some of you guys recommended to me so you guys wish me luck on it i hope it worked great on my hair now for my pre poo treatment i did a recent video with the girls last wash day in our home I told you guys you can use that as a pre poo treatment and also as a deep condition treatment so in this video i will be using it as a pre poo treatment for you guys to also see how it works both ways if you see me looking down i got everything right in front of me <laughs> that's why i just keep looking down my pre poo treatment i got my aloe vera juice here and then i got my Greek yogurt I'm just going to use all of this because we are also trying to clear the fridge out and my hair is very thick and in the extra love and attention so I'm going to be very heavy handed with that and then I got my organic moringa powder this is the same ingredient but I'm just sitting down and talking to you guys while mixing it and then i got my s secrets group oil which is my 21 growth oil ingredients you guys love this oil this oil is selling so so great and i also love it and then i also got my carol growth oil you guys want me to also start selling this this is it's going to be a lot be, to sell this carol growth oil because this s secrets growth oil and the caffeine growth oil it takes a lot for us to make this oil just imagine it's 21 different natural ingredients in here and it takes us three weeks to a month just for the infusion so it already taking all of our time and effort now to also add this into it it's going to be a lot but i plan to just do this uh like a seasoner stuff maybe just do that once or twice a year just create it and then first time first sir since you guys love it also too much and this is also great as a pre pre treatment just so if you're using the s secrets growth or you have something back up for that so i'm going to be using both of them in this treatment and then what else one one two three four five yes it's five ingredient so i got my five ingredient here i'm first just going to put the yogurt into the bowl and then i would just put in my moringa powder add in the oils mix them up and then it turned out too thick so i'm also going to add in some of my aloe vera juice just to get the perfect consistency that i want so let me just go off camera and i will mix that up quick and then i will come back for us to start applying it to my so i kind of pre pre treatment ready i'm done mixing it i made it a little bit runny because my hair is completely dry so i'm just going to start applying it on my hair in smaller sections i really don't know how life gonna be with us in the hotel with hair wash day and so <laughs> i'm thinking um for the first one week or two weeks, I shouldn't even bother to wash our hair because it's going to be difficult. I don't have my ingredients with me. I'm probably just going to look into some natural store-bought products 
So, if you know about some natural store-bought product that you trust, they use all natural ingredients, let me know about it. I don't know about much. I know about like Maya Organic and what, the main chores and then what else? I know about some random ones, but yeah, I think I would look, try to look into that to just pick up few things from the store for us to be using while we are in the hotel because it's going to be difficult <laughs> for me to be mixing things I wish I don't even have because I packed everything. The only ingredient that I left out is this my Marinka powder. So if anything, I'll just be mixing it in like a store-bought deep condition or store-bought product. But let's see, maybe I wouldn't even have to wash our hair. Maybe everything will fall in place. So I'm just keeping positive, hoping that everything will work out faster than what we are imagining it to be. So I'm just gonna take my time and then keep applying it to my scalp in my hair. I think this section is pretty good right now let me just add a little bit more so you guys get to see how it's applied on like a type 3 here, my daughter's here. And then if you have a hair texture similar to mine, you can also see how it's working for me. And I can see it's also defining my curls. From very dry to very hydrated curls. See that? Okay, so I'm just gonna put this section away and move to the next section. And I'm just gonna keep doing that until I'm done with my full head of hair. My hair is really growing. treatment to my entire hair I think I'm just gonna use this treatment also as a pre point of deep condition treatment just to cut my wash day down because I still need to go and pack things because the way it got my hair feeling right now I don't even think I need a deep condition treatment after this so I'm gonna go and sit under my steamer for 20 minutes and then I would just leave it on for an hour and then after I will rinse it out and go in with my homemade shampoo. So after my shampoo, I will just moisturize my hair because it's just going to be a lot of work. And I think this treatment is killing one bird. No, what, what's the parable? Using one stone to kill two birds. So using it as a pre put treatment and a deep condition treatment. But can you guys see how my hair is really growing? It's just, is it just me saying this or my hair is really looking 
longer than the last time I did it. And it's also very, very heavy, by the way. Very, very heavy. Okay, family, so I'm just going to go and pull it in smaller twist so that my steamer can be able to sit on my hair because with all of this hair, it's going to be difficult to get the steamer to cover it up. So I'm not even going to try doing that. So I'm going to go and pull it in like four to five twists so I can be able to sit on my steamer. And then after, I will come and show you guys the final result or I will just probably just end the video here when I become too busy. So if you see the video end here, then I'm sorry. I'm moving. I got a lot of work to do and I need to catch up. So if you love this video, please do not forget to give me a like, leave a comment down below and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.